Yo, what's up guys? In today's video, I'm going to be playing my new log bait deck. I finally have a new log bait deck that does better against the meta, against Ian77 here. So if you guys enjoy the video, please make sure to like and subscribe. So my new log bait deck is literally just bomb tower for the cannon. It's much better in the meta though, because everybody has like archers and goblins and a lot of people play with like royal hogs and stuff like that. So it's just really nice to have the bomb tower to splash stuff from behind and not only hit one thing at a time like the cannon does. I'm just going to go for my goblins here for the prince. And I'll just go for my ice spirit plus goblin barrel at the bridge here. He's probably going to musk in the middle. Yeah, goes for musk in the middle. And he also goes for the bats. That's going to get a lot of damage though. His prince does get a nice charge though, unfortunately. But I got more damage than he did. So I think it's okay. In this matchup, the bomb tower is going to help out quite a lot. Because I know that he's playing Mega Knight wall breakers. So bomb tower is going to be able to splash onto the prince and the mega knight if he puts them in the same lane which they almost always do they just they like to go like mega knight prince plus minor to get some chip damage it's like a really hard push to stop just gonna go for my princess in the back here pretty annoying play for him he either has to arrows it or i get a lot of value goes through the mega knight in the back pretty interesting mega knight i don't really agree with it <laughs> leave it to ian to make mistakes um i'll just go for my mighty minor on top of the mega knight I'll put it like this so it jumps on top of the Mega Knight and my Princess stays alive. I'll go for my... Actually, I don't even need the Goblins. It's just going to die. That was a really bad zap. <laughs> I'm just going to go for a Barrel here. Goes for the Arrows. Just going to go for my Ice Spirit plus Princess at the bridge. Just wanted to cycle back to my Princess. I'm already one card off of luck. Wait, what are those bats? <laughs> those were some Ian bats. <laughs> I'm going to wait for him to counter this. I'm going to Goblins. Oh, I tried to catch it. Okay, I'm just going to go for my Barrel now. And he, he actually can't defend this. <laughs> that was an Ian bats. He just reactively put the bats into my Ice Spirit. <laughs> okay, just going to Ice Spirit the bridge here. See what he does. He doesn't do anything. So I guess I'm just going to go for my Princess at the bridge here to finish off the tower. Very nice Princess at the bridge there. I'm just going to go for my Mighty Miner in the back here because he went for Mega Knight in the back. Always want to go Mighty Miner into their Mega Knight. If you don't have Mighty Miner for their Mega Knight, you're probably in trouble. Just going to go for my Bomb Tower here for the Mega Knight. And I'm just going to go for a Rocket on the Prince. Not going to take any risks. I'm going to log it as well and go for Goblins for the Miner. Oh, Ice Spirit. Okay, yeah, nice. That's the power of the Bomb Tower right there. Just splashing onto the Prince from behind. And now I'm just going to go for Goblins on the Wall Breakers. And that should be good game. So I'll see you guys in the next match. <laughs> Ian is so bad. Look, I mean, this was just embarrassing. I'm in the next game here against this guy. Just going to go for my Ice Spirit Goblin Barrel at the bridge. I know that this guy plays with three Musketeers, so going to be a pretty good matchup for me because he doesn't have Log or Mirror. He only has Zap, so he can't defend Goblin Barrel and he can't get a huge Elixir lead. Just going to go for my Mighty Miner here on the Bandit. Mighty Miner is going to counter the Golden Knight and the Bandit. Really nice Mighty Miner. He's probably going to go for a Royal Ghost on top of my Princess. The annoying thing about this deck is that he doesn't even have to use his three Musketeers. He has a lot of Bridge Bam cards. He has Ghost, Bandit, E-Barbs, and Golden Knight. So, it's going to go for my Ice Spirit on the E-Barbs here just to make sure that the Bomb Tower finishes them off. And then I'll just go for my Goblin Barrel here on the left. I think he'll just zap it. He could also pump in the middle and ignore it. Probably just zap. Okay, he goes for the Ghost. That was a good Ghost forgot that he had that in cycle just gonna go for my mighty miner here on the royal ghost and then he has to defend it still so goes for pump i'm just gonna hmm, i'm gonna princess bridge and not rocket the pump the reason i'm gonna princess the bridge and not rocket the pump is that i'm confident enough that with the bomb tower splash that i can defend while being down and he didn't really have a great response for the princess as well just gonna log on all the musketeers and the pump always want to be fast i'll just go for my bomb tower here in the middle i'll go for my goblins on the bandit over here so the heal spirit doesn't heal the musk and then i'll go for my ice spirit on the musketeer as well okay i'm just gonna take a few musketeer shots on each side but i think it was worth it because i got a lot of damage on the left and he's splitting up his damage i'm just gonna go for another goblin barrel here in a second okay i'll go for my goblin barrel now goes for golden knight he tried to predict my princess i'll go for the mighty miner on the golden knight and that's gonna help defend the e-barbs i think i'll have to bomb tower as well but it's okay yeah, I'm going to pop the ability and then just go for my bomb tower. Pop the ability. Oh, nice. He just sacrificed the ghost. <laughs> and he has to defend it again, I'm pretty sure. That's going to take the tower or get a lot of damage. It's going to go for my princess bridge. I'm going to go for my goblins and I'll just go for a goblin barrel. Then I'll just go for my ice spear here on the bandit. Very nice ice spear. And I forced out zap on the right with the mighty minor goblins. Okay, I'll go for my princess in the back here opposite lane of the 
Golden Knight, and I'm not going to rocket that pump. I'm just going to let it go and try to get some barrel damage. I'm going to go for goblins here behind the Golden Knight. You always want to put your goblins behind the Golden Knight, because then we'll only dash onto one of them. Goes for the E-barbs. That's a lot of bomb tower value. Just going to go for my bomb tower here. He might try to bandit snipe it. Yeah, just going to go for my mighty miner here. Going to ice spirit to freeze everything. And then I'll just go for the ability here. Messed up the ice spirit a little bit, but look at that bomb tower. Cannon would never do that. Just going to go for my princess here in the middle to snipe the two musketeers. And then I'll go for my log just to make sure that they die. That's the thing about this matchup. You can just go for your princess on the two musketeers and just go for log and it's dead no matter what they do because they can't kill your princess. I'll just go for my mighty miner on the ghost and I'm going to go for my barrel in the back here because when he golden knight abilities, it will only hit one goblin. So it's not going to work. Yup, and he didn't know that. So that's going to put it down to 500. It's going to go for my log and a bomb tower. Okay, that's not going to hit. Perfect. I just need to defend for like a little bit more. I need like 100 more damage and I can rocket log. Just going to go for my mighty miner here. Going to go for my barrel to pressure while defending. I'll go for my log. Oh, he has no elixir now. Let's go. Nice win there. That's why you always want to pressure while defending because he just couldn't um, defend my goblin barrel since I put a goblin barrel right as he was spamming me and he didn't have any elixir left. I'm in the next game here against Clem. Just going to go for my ice spirit here at the bridge. Going to go for my princess in the back. I know that this guy plays with Pekka, Ram Rider, Arrows, Earthquake, Bar Barrel, e -Wiz, Golden Knight, Mother Witch, so pretty hard matchup for me, I feel like, because he has Earthquake for my building, Arrows for Goblins or Princess, Bar Barrel for my Goblin Barrel, e -Wiz to reset Mighty, Mother Witch just spawn pigs on my Goblins or Goblin Barrel, and just Golden Knight is completely broken. He's going to go for my Mighty Miner plus Ice Spirit here on the Ram Rider. On top of him not being able to spell it, he still has to defend it, whereas if I just put the bomb tower, then he doesn't have to defend it anymore. Okay, he goes for the Mother Witch. I'm just going to go for my Princess in the back here. Mighty Miner will completely kill the Mother Witch, which is great. I'll go for my Goblin Barrel here on the right. See what he wants to do. Probably just... Okay, he goes for the E-Wiz. Um, I'll go for my Log on the E-Wiz plus Hog. I'll go for the Ice Spirit in the middle as well. Okay, he goes for the Golden Knight. I'll just go for my Goblins on top of the Golden Knight. Goblins are always great against Golden Knight now that I know that I can put them right behind and he can't even dash or because it won't really do anything. I'm just going to go for my princess in the back here. He goes for P.E.K.K.A. in the back. Pretty interesting P.E.K.K.A. Um, I can't really punish him for it though, unfortunately, because he has so many counters. Just going to go for my Goblin Barrel here on the left. Goes for the Bar Barrel. That's fine with me. I'm just going to go for my Mighty Miner in the middle here. And princess is still going to survive, so he still has to defend it, which is perfect. I'll go for my Ice Spirit, and then I'll go for my Goblin just to surround the P.E.K.K.A. Keep the Mighty Miner alive. Really bad Mother Witch by him. I don't agree with that. Just going to go for my Log here on the Mother Witch. I'll go for my Goblin Barrel on the left as well. Then once he arrows, I'll just go for my Princess. Okay, yeah, I put that right as he hit three Elixir, so he can't really defend this right away. Goes for the E-Wiz. I'll go for my Goblins on top of the E-Wiz, and then I'll go for Ice Spirit and... A goblin barrel. I don't want to do it just yet. He goes for the ram rider first. I'll go for the goblin barrel now, and then I'll go for my bomb tower in the middle here. I don't know how I'm supposed to break through. He has so many counters. Um, If he packs in the back, I'm going to go Princess Mighty Miner at the bridge. He doesn't have Ewas in hand or Golden Knight. Okay, going to go for Mighty Miner Princess. He does have Golden Knight now. Going to go for my barrel. He goes for the Ewas. Um, that's fine. That's so much damage. He doesn't have arrows or barb barrel, and the Ewas is going to die to the Mighty Miner. Okay, I'm going to go for my bomb tower here. That's so much damage. Look, look at the princess. Okay, going to go for my goblins here to pull back the P.E.K.K.A. Goes for the mother witch. Really bad mother witch. The pigs are just going to die to my bomb tower. Okay, goes for that. I'm just going to go for my log here. And I'll go for ice spirit to block the golden knight. Go for mighty miner to pull it back. And that was really good by me. I got so much damage on his tower. And I only need a little bit more before I can go two rockets, two logs. I think I win this game. If I lose this, I'm just bad. I'm going to pop the ability here for the E-Wiz. And then, then I'll go for my princess in the middle, and I'll log right away just to make sure that the e -wiz dies. And he still has to defend my princess, so that's nice. And then I can just set up a bomb tower in the middle. Okay, nice. Just gonna go bomb tower. I'll go for goblin barrel as well. Switching up the placement just in case he gets too careless. I'm gonna go for my goblins here to pull away the P.E.K.K.A. Go for my ice spirit on the mother witch. And then I'll just go for my log on the bar barrel. And I think I'll just go for a princess down low to make sure that those don't get a hit on my tower. I'm going to barrel here, force him to arrows. Oh, he got greedy. Okay, I'm going to rock it. That's going to hit the golden knight. Okay, why didn't he use the ability? <laughs> I'm just going to go for ice spirit plus log here on the e -Wiz. Kill it. Make sure my princess lives. I'm going to go for bomb tower on the ram rider. 
Very nice bomb tower. Completely wasted the Mother Witch. And then I just need to cycle back to my Goblin Barrel. I mean, not my Goblin Barrel, my Rocket in that game. Yeah, he gave up. Just going to Barrel here. A very nice win against this guy. Pretty tough matchup for me, but I kind of made it look like it was my matchup. <laughs> but Bomb Tower helped a lot compared to Cannon because it survives the Earthquake. I'm in the next game here against this guy. Just going to go for my Goblin Barrel first play. I don't want to Ice Spirit with it because I know he's playing Giant Double Prince and he might just Arrows. He goes for the Dark Prince. That's fine. I still get two shots on the tower, which is great. I'm going to go for my Ice Spirit here for the Dark Prince. I'll go for my Princess in the middle. Goes for the Miner. I'll just go for my Log on the Miner and go for my Mighty Miner on the Dark Prince. I know I spent a lot of Elixir there, but he still has to defend my Mighty Miner and my Princess. I'll just go for a Barrel with this as well. Goes for the Phoenix. Oh no, I'm down a lot of Elixir. I'm going to pop the ability just to get the damage on the tower though. I'm confident in my defense. Goes for the Prince. Really good Prince by him knowing I'd pop the ability for the damage. I'm just going to go for my Bomb Tower here for the Prince and the Giant. This is where Bomb Tower is going to come in clutch, though. It's splashing onto everything. Look at that Bomb Tower, and then I can just go for a log on the Phoenix Egg. I'll do it now. I don't want to do it until last second. Bro. <laughs> no way. Okay, whatever. I'm just going to let that get the one or two shots in the tower, and then I'll go for my Ice Spirit here on the Dark Prince, and I can just go for my Mighty Miner to finish it off. And he still has to defend the Mighty Miner, which is nice. So let's go e -wiz. What? What was that e -wiz? <laughs> What? When I said he's going to go for Ewas, I thought he was going to put it in the middle, not right on top of it. Now he has to waste a miner. I'll go for my barrel. He has to go for arrows or zap as soon as he can. He goes for zap. Okay, I'm going to goblins the bridge straight away. He doesn't have any elixir for this. What can he do? Like arrows last second? Okay, nice. I got a hit. Okay, I'm just going to princess at the bridge. That was really bad. What was that Ewas? <laughs> okay, nice. Two shots. Let me get a third. Three, three, three. Nice, that's three shots in the tower. That's like 600 damage. I'm gonna go for my Ice Spirit here on the Dark Prince, and then I'll just go for Mighty Miner. And then, wait, if I barrel, he doesn't have arrows, he doesn't have zap. He could like e -wiz, Prince, or Phoenix, but that's it. That's still a lot of damage for me. I'm just gonna go for barrel here. He has no arrows. Goes for the Phoenix. Yeah, that's gonna. Oh, it hit at the Goblin. That's tower. Let's go. <laughs> nice. Um, I just need to defend now for 50 seconds. I'm just going to go for my goblins in the back. I'll go for my bomb tower as well for the giant. He did that just to space them out so it can't get by the bomb tower. But I'll just go for a nice rocket on the prince and the phoenix and the giant. I'll go for my log and then I'll go for my goblins. Ooh, look at the bomb tower again. Splashing the prince right away. So I didn't even need to play those goblins, but I just did it just in case, I guess. I didn't expect the bomb tower to splash it. Okay, he's going for the phoenix in the back. I'll just go for my princess in the back here. And it should be game. There's no way I lose from here unless I lag out. I'm um, just going to go for my Ice Spirit here on the Dark Prince. I'll go for my Mighty Miner. And then I'll just go for my Goblins to catch the Miner. I'll play my Log. Go for a Princess. And, oh, okay, I'll just Ice Spirit. And I should be good. It's going to get a, quite a bit of damage, but it doesn't really matter. I have 3,200 HP left. So, yeah, nice win. I'll see you guys in the next game. I'm in the next game here against this guy. Just going to go for my Log here. Goes for the Fire Spirit. I'm just going to go for my Goblins. I know that this guy plays with Electro Giant, so it's going to be a pretty annoying matchup. I hate facing Electro Giant just because of the Golden Knight. I'll go for my Goblin Barrel here in the corner. He goes for the Bar Barrel. It's fine. I'll go for my Princess at the Bridge on the right. Princess at the Bridge is really good against Electro Giant, especially when they play with the Fire Spirit because they don't have that many cards to kill your Princess whenever you put it at the Bridge. Just a very annoying play. Just go for my Ice Spirit here on the Phoenix, but... The one thing about Princess at the Bridge that many people don't know is that I don't Princess the Bridge when they have a Phoenix in their hand unless I have an Ice Spirit for it. Like, in single Elixir like this, when both the towers are even, I just Princess at the Bridge when I have Ice Spirit so then I can counter the Phoenix with my Ice Spirit because anything else is just a negative trade. So you always want to have Ice Spirit when you do it. Only in single Elixir, in my opinion. In double Elixir, it's okay as long as you have, like, your Goblins. But you don't want to do any more than just Goblins. I'm going to go for my Ice Spirit at the back, and I'll go for Mighty Miner here, just to make sure that I kill a Gold Knight. And if he goes for the E-Giant, I'll just go for a Far Bomb Tower. Okay, he goes for the Golden Knight ability, and he wastes his Fire Spirit, so I'm going to Goblin's Bridge since he used the Fire Spirit, and I'll Bomber on the right. I mean, not Bomber, Goblin Barrel. <laughs> Oops. Okay, nice. My Goblin's got, oh my god, 900 damage. Okay, I'm just going to go for my Princess here for the Phoenix, and then I'll go for my Ice Spirit just to pull it backwards. Always nice to counter the Phoenix with your Ice Spirit. It always feels nice because it's such a good card, but it gets countered so easily on offense. Okay, just going to go for my Goblins here at the bridge just to cycle. And I'll go, for my, I'll go for my Mighty Miner, and I'll go for 
a goblin barrel here on the left. Nice, very nice mighty miner keeping my princess alive. I'll go for a princess at the bridge here on the right, and then I'll go for my ice spear on the phoenix, and then I'll go for my goblins as well, just to keep the princess alive and keep being annoying. And then I'll go for my goblin barrel here on the left. Looking good for me so far. I've already got 1200 damage on each side. Gonna log the fire spirit. Very nice. Gonna go for my princess to keep my princess alive. Gonna ice spirit to block the barb. Nice. This is looking really good. Kind of mighty here. I know that he's going to go for the ability, but I'll just go for my goblin rare as well. Hopefully he messes up the NATO, but I kind of have to give him the king tire activation to try to get some damage. Okay, wait, I could get the ability off right now. Nice. Got the ability off as well. Extra 500 damage. Just going to go for my log here, and then I'll go for my princess in the middle for the phoenix. Nice. Okay, just going to go for my ice spirit here in the back. Going to go for my mighty miner as well. Want to get my three card cycle. In this matchup, you kind of want to pre-cycle your bomb towers and go for Goblin's Ice Spirit on top of DE Giant. Just because it gets a ton of damage. Just going to go for my early bomb tower here. Going to pop the ability so he can't lightning both. And then I'll go for my barrel. We'll also kill the Golden Knight, which is perfect. Always want to make sure your Mighty can kill the Golden Knight. Because that's like the biggest threat. I'll go for my Princess in the back here. The only thing is that this is kind of an awkward situation since I don't have a pre-bomb tower to cycle. And even though I am going to do it now... He can just get a good lightning off on my princess, my bomb tower, and the tower. I'm just going to go for my barrel here on the left, and then I'm going to rock it on the phoenix plus e-giant. A log to kill the egg, and then I'll just finish off the e-giant with my ice spirit plus goblins. Very nice log hitting the fire spirit too. That e-giant's now dead. Rocket log, ice spirit goblins does kill the e-giant. Kind of like a weird thing to know, but it does. Um, Okay, very nice barrel there. He tried to predict princess, so he didn't have enough to defend the barrel. I'm going to just pre-cycle my bomb tower here. You always want to be able to cycle to a second bomb tower. Okay, just going to go for my ice spirit. I'm going to goblins here. I'm going to go for log, and then I'll just go for my bomb tower to kill the golden knight and the uh, e-giant. Okay, I have to mighty miner too. That's fine. Okay, just going to go for my ice spirit here on the golden knight just to make sure that he can't get the dash off. Oh, and that's going to kill the phoenix. Just going to go for my princess in the back here. I'll go for my barrel, and then I just need to pre-cycle a bomb tower. I'm going to ice spirit here, and then I'm going to get my goblins down he's probably gonna fire a spirit he goes for the early early lightning i'm gonna goblins here i'm gonna barrel as well just because he doesn't have bar barrel in hand i'll go for my bomb tower here for the e-giant and then i'll go for my mighty miner on top of the phoenix just so the bomb tower lives and then i'll go for my rocket on the e-giant pop the ability to kill the phoenix egg go for ice spirit plus log here on the e-giant just keep my bomb tower alive as long as possible i'll go for a new bomb tower go for my goblins on the golden knight very nice defense. That defense was so clean. Just going to Mighty Miner here for that. I'll go for my Ice Spirit. I'll go for my Log. And I'm already back to another Bomb Tower. And he doesn't have Lightning in Cycle. So that's going to be game. Thank you guys for watching. Like and subscribe if you enjoyed. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.